Hi foodies and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to do a vegetable bake. So I've got some chili cheese I thought of, some pak choy, some cabbage that I cut up and some carrots. And I'm going to be using garlic spread and Philadelphia garlic and herbs. So let's get this on the road. So as you see, I've already put my garlic butter in and I've put in one small onion to start off with. I want to batch bake these and I'll show you what it looks like, I'll give it a little taste, but they will be going into the freezer. For another day. So I'm just going to let my onions cook, cook in that. Don't forget we'll have recipe week coming up very shortly. I've already started gathering my ingredients. For the recipe week. Which I hope you'll stick around. And subscribe to watch that. I would like to thank everyone that subscribed, everyone that views my videos. I do appreciate that very much. I would love if you can, if you're watching this and you haven't subscribed, I'd love it if you would subscribe. I put a video out nearly every day. I'll just give them a few minutes. The next ingredient is a pack toy. Let that roll down a little bit. Now I'm doing this on a low heat because I don't want to burn anything. Now I'm just going to add a tiny amount of water. Now that's wilted down nicely. Then we're going to add the carrots and the cabbage. We just want that to work down a little bit before we add our cream cheese.
I've never done this by the way, it's just something that I came up with and thought of trying. But that's what cooking's all about, isn't it? Experimenting. So I'm going to let this cook for a small while and then I will bring you back. Now I'm going to add some salt. And some black pepper. I you could put pasta in this as well, but I'm not. I just want a simple vegetable dish. You could use it as a, as a side. And now I'm going to add half a pack of the Philadelphia cheese and you just want to melt that down with the vegetables so I'm going to continue to cook this and I'll bring you back when I'm putting it in my little dishes to bake off now I've already done a couple of them. I'm going to show you on this one what I did. So we're just going to sprinkle cheese. And as I said, you can use this as a side. And then I'll put that in my air fryer to cook. And then I'll show you what it looks like when it's cooked. And they have it cooked. I want to give this a little taste. It's piping hot. Mm. Cheesy, garlicky, that actually works. And we can see the vegetables out, just lifted up. So that's all for this one foodies if you like the content please give it a like please consider subscribing please click the notification bell for new uploads and as, as always leave a comment in the comment box that's all for this one thanks for watching bye